Today, we're ditching the mainstream and embarking on an adventure to some of Europe's weirdest and most unique museums. Think of a 16th century megaship in Sweden, or canine couture in England, and, well, let's just say things get weirder from there. No dusty exhibits or hushed whispers here. These hidden gems are all about sparking curiosity, unleashing your inner child, and making memories you won't soon forget. So buckle up, because in this report, the Travel Insiders are diving headfirst into 10 of Europe's most unusual museums. Let's go! Number one, the Neon Museum, Warsaw. This isn't your typical history museum. Instead, this place bursts with colorful ghosts of the past, faded Soviet-era signs glowing like embers of a bygone era. Imagine these vibrant messages pulsating above bustling streets, luring customers and extolling communist ideals. As you wander through this neon graveyard, you'll witness the evolution of neon design, from stark simplicity to playful flourishes. Skilled glassbenders have breathed new life into these fading remnants, reminding us of Warsaw's resilience and the fleeting beauty of neon's electric glow. So step into the light, let the colors wash over you, and feel the pulse of history beating in every flickering sign. Number two, Vasa Museum, Stockholm. Travel back in time and see a giant old ship at the Vasa Museum in Sweden. This amazing building holds a nearly complete warship from the 1600s called the Vasa. The Vasa was launched with much celebration in 1628, but it sank on its maiden voyage just outside Stockholm due to its flamboyant design and strong winds. After hundreds of years underwater, it was finally brought up in 1961 in an amazing feat of marine archaeology. Now, the Vasa Museum shows both the amazingness and the weakness of shipbuilding in the 1600s. Walk around the museum and be amazed by the Vasa's tall masts and fancy carvings, all carefully fixed to look like they did way back then. Number 3. Micropia, Amsterdam Beyond Amsterdam's canals and windmills lies a hidden gem for curious minds. Micropia, the world's first museum dedicated to the tiniest titans of our planet. Microbes! Here, you'll shrink down to microscopic size and explore a world teeming with invisible neighbors. Imagine bacteria bigger than your hand, see viruses recreated in dazzling colors, and even watch your own gut microbes come to life on screen. It's not just educational, it's mind-blowing. You'll learn how these tiny creatures sculpt our planet, shape our health, and even influence the food we eat. Micropia is an adventure for all ages, a playful reminder that the biggest wonders often come in the smallest packages. So, next time you're in Amsterdam, pack your curiosity and get ready to be amazed by the power of the tiniest things. Number four, Chaco Story, Brussels. Brussels is calling you to Chaco Story, the museum that's all about chocolate. Forget stuffy galleries, here the smell of cocoa fills the air, making your mouth water. Dive into Mayan and Aztec rituals that started this beloved treat. Then, see the magic of turning beans into bars. Watch expert chocolatiers make pralines with practiced hands, each bite a symphony of creamy textures and rich flavors. Do fun things like making your own chocolate or designing your dream praline. It's a Willy Wonka wonderland for grown-ups, where the only ticket you need is a sweet tooth and a love for all things chocolatey. So step inside, get ready to be tempted, and let Brussels Choco Story melt your heart and taste buds with its delicious, delightful story. Number five, National Tile Museum, Lisbon. Forget dusty paintings and look instead at walls bursting with color at the National Tile Museum. Housed in a beautiful old convent, this vibrant gem takes you on a dazzling journey through Portuguese tiles called Azulejos. Step into sunny courtyards decorated with intricate geometric patterns, then lose yourself in sprawling murals showing historical scenes and mythical creatures. Trace the evolution of Azulejos from Moorish influences to Baroque grandeur, each tile a vibrant storyteller whispering tales of Portugal's past. Don't miss the amazing 75-foot panorama of Lisbon before an earthquake, 
a stunning testament to the city's strength and beauty. Immerse yourself in this kaleidoscope of color, where art seamlessly blends with architecture, and every tile sings a unique melody of Portugal's rich cultural heritage. Number 6. The Museum of Piping, Glasgow Forget quiet halls and hushed reverence. Glasgow's museum dedicated to all things bagpipes throws you headfirst into the kilted world of the Highland Pipes. Picture this. Walls lined with shiny bagpipes and chanters, their polished wood whispering tales of windswept hills and fierce battles. Hear the haunting melody echo through the air, a shiver running down your spine as you imagine kilted warriors marching into battle. Learn about this instrument's fascinating evolution, from its ancient roots to its modern forms. Watch skilled craftsmen assemble pipes, their deft hands coaxing music from wood and silver. And if you're feeling brave, try your hand at the chanter yourself. Who knows, you might just unleash your inner Highlander and bagpipe your way to a newfound appreciation for this iconic Scottish symbol. Number 7. Museum of Broken Relationships, Zagreb. This museum tells an unconventional love story, not with grand gestures, but with everyday objects whispering tales of love and loss. Here, a lonely mismatched sock symbolizes the ache of a breakup, a washing machine abandoned by a dish-averse partner speaks volumes, and even love letters scribbled on airplane napkins become poignant keepsakes. Each item is a silent testament to the bittersweet tapestry of human connection. But the museum isn't just about heartbreak, it celebrates resilience, acceptance, and the enduring power of our connections. So come laugh, cry, and remember that even in endings, there's beauty, humor, and a shared human experience that binds us all. This is a special place to reflect on the complexities of love and the stories woven into the fabric of every relationship. Number 8. Shagalip Hair Museum, Cappadocia Nestled in the heart of Turkey, hidden beneath a pottery shop, lies a museum unlike any other. The Shagalip Hair Museum is a celebration of women, memories, and the power of a single strand. It began with a friend's farewell. Potter Shea Galip, touched by her gift of a lock of hair, started a tradition. Soon, women from around the world, captivated by his story and charm, followed suit. Today, over 16,000 strands adorn the walls, ceiling, and even peek from behind pottery. Each lock tells a tale of love, loss, and the universal language of connection you'll find fiery red next to silvered gray, each strand a testimony to the diverse beauty of women. This place is a reminder that even the smallest gesture, like a single lock of hair, can create something extraordinary. If you're seeking a unique encounter with a touch of magic, let your hair down at the Shea Galip Hair Museum. Number nine, the Dog Collar Museum, Leeds. Step into a canine fashion extravaganza at Leeds Castle in Kent, England. At the Dog Collar Museum, you'll see collars from across centuries. From spiky medieval armor protecting noble hounds to bejeweled Victorian masterpieces fit for a pampered duchess. Witness how dog collar design changed from practical tools to playful accessories, each piece telling a story of our furry companion's evolving role in society. Picture the clanging of iron collars on hunting hounds, the tinkling bells of Elizabethan lapdogs, and the sleek leather of modern designer collars. This isn't just a museum, it's a tribute to the enduring bond between humans and dogs, told through the surprising history of their neckwear. So, unleash your inner dog lover and discover the fascinating world where canine fashion barks louder than words. Number 10 the Icelandic Phallological Museum, Reykjavik. This museum celebrates all things phallic, with a cheeky grin. Prepare for a chuckle, or maybe a blush, as you explore a quirky collection of specimens from across the animal kingdom, from the whale's impressive appendage to the earthworm's microscopic masterpiece. Witness ancient fertility symbols, marvel at modern prosthetic innovations, and giggle at the bizarre creations in the art phallus section. This isn't just a museum, it's a conversation starter, a chance to explore the often taboo topic of the phallus with humor, curiosity, and maybe even a touch of awe. 
So step into the wacky world of Iceland's Phallological Museum, where every giggle guarantees a memory that's anything but limp. Okay, travelers, we've journeyed through 10 cool and quirky museums across Europe. But this is just the tip of the iceberg when it comes to unusual museums. As you plan your next vacation, keep your eyes peeled for the oddities and the interesting stories hiding in plain sight. These treasures will be the ones you talk about years down the line. We believe the perfect trip combines the expected with a bit of the unexpected, so go forth and explore this weird and wonderful world. Like and subscribe for more travel tips and inspiration, and happy travels!